Hey guys, Ryan here. Today we're going to be doing the Walking Dead issue 168 variant cover discussion. And man, this cover is sweet. This is 168 variant. It's very gory with that walker and it's sweet with Jesus on it, kicking butt. Here's the original cover in case you missed it. You got Negan and all the saviors bowing down to him. So let's talk about this variant cover. Um, yeah, I know what it's for, but, um, that's not how I'm going to look at this variant cover. Not that I, I don't have anything against... Um, those people. I don't have anything against you. Um, it's just, when I look at Walking Dead, I don't immediately think of gay, lesbian people. I, that's not what I want this cover to be. I don't want it to specifically be to other people. You guys are normal. You guys are, you guys are fine the way you are. It's just your choice. It's, it's a choice that not everybody always makes. But it's a choice that you can make as a human being. It's your choice and it's okay if that's what you chose. That's how I'm looking at this. And this variant cover is sweet, okay? I, but when I look at this, I'm not going to immediately think of those people. Because those people are fine. They don't need a special cover to represent they, that those people are cool and fine. It's not the people and the choices that they make. That the personal choices that they make. It's about the personality and who the person is. So if you actually have something against these kind of people, well, then keep it to yourself, okay? Because that's just mean to pick on people and call them gay or lesbian. That is mean. This cover is awesome. I like this cover. When I think of this cover, I'm not going to immediately think of gay and lesbian people because you guys are fine. You guys don't need a special cover representing how awesome you guys are. You guys are normal people just... A different decision. You guys look at other people the same way. If they, if a guy marries a girl, you guys look at them the same way. They're different than us. We look at you guys and say, you're different than us. It's the same way. It's just one decision shouldn't define that person. One decision shouldn't make you look at that person completely different. That person is a human being. They deserve respect. And they deserve what they were born to deserve. So, when I look at this cover, yeah, I'm probably going to think of them and... But when I but what I want to think of is Walking Dead. That's why I'm getting the issue. These people that the the flag and everything that represents those people, they are fine people. They are, have done nothing wrong. So when I look at this, when I get this issue, I am gonna be happy with it. I am really excited to get this cover. This cover is so sweet with Jesus on it. Um, another thing I just realized a minute ago too is um, issue one sixty seven was Aaron's. 100 issue, uh, like, representative thing, um, because he was introduced on the last page of issue 67, and then issue 167 he was in, so that is pretty cool, so let's talk about this variant, this variant is very, very awesome, I don't think it will represent anything for this story, though, I think it's just a cool variant someone whipped up, and they thought that they should put it on there and sell it, um, because as you can see, it's not even by the artist, and unless Robert Kirkman, which probably he won't, reveal the story to the, um, to this artist, it probably does have nothing. It probably doesn't have anything to do with the story. But I'm guessing this cover does. This is the original cover that will be that was released a while ago for issue 168. This is the variant cover, which is cool. I like them both just as much. I think they're both really, really awesome. Um, I just have a quick prediction for it. Um, for issue 168, I probably will talk about this in my predictions video, and also just so you guys know, um. I did have made a new rule for my channel. It is um, that I will do my predictions video after we get the preview. So I have a little bit more to base my predictions off of. And I can review the preview on here and get my predictions. Because I will do anything to get my predictions video up. One time I tried to do the 165 preview review and I didn't even get it up. Because, you know, they release it that Friday before the issue comes out. But then when it's a predictions video, I'm like, heck, I'll do anything to get those videos up. Since it was just a little preview review with only three panels, I was like, eh, it's not a big deal. But when I have my predictions video and the preview one video, I will try to get it. I will definitely get that up one way or another. Hopefully. I'm sorry. I can't make any more promises. I made a promise and it failed for the 166 review, and I'm very sorry about that still. So, first of all, let's talk about, um, oh, did I, no, I never said my 166, my 168 predictions. Okay, so, what I'm thinking is based off of the 169 cover, which is the one with Dwight standing over Rick pointing a gun to his head. 
when I have, what I'm thinking for that issue is, you you guys are gonna be like, wow, that's a big prediction. I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. But I kind of want this to happen. This would be sweet. I mean, I don't want it to. I mean, I don't want it to happen. But it would be pretty cool to see Dwight come up behind Rick and have a gun to his head. Think about it for a minute. So, like, so you know how sometimes at the end of an issue they have it where it's like a little one panel sometimes, just one one panel at the top, and then they have like a really a lot bigger panel at the bottom. Um, that's what I want for this issue. I want this issue to be like, so the top panel is just Rick standing there trying to talk to the savers, and all of a sudden a gun is to the back of his head. And then the bottom panel is like a forward view, where you see Rick right there with the gun to his head, and Dwight right there behind him, saying, you screwed up, Rick. You, sh you killed her. Don't move. That would be a sweet ending. But then when you think about it, you'd have to wait a whole other volume to get the next issue. Just saying... Um, so, that would be very cool, though. But for, I'm talking about, like, the people that don't get the single issues, they just get the volumes. So, depending, it just all, this issue, see, this issue is the end of the story arc for issue one, for issue 163 through 168. Then, after that, we're going to be getting 169 through 174. There's so much to come for Walking Dead, and I'm very excited. But So let's get back to the issue 168. So that prediction about Dwight and stuff will definitely be carried over to my predictions video. But we're here to walk, talk about the variant. Um, I kind of gave everything I thought about it. I think this cover is flipping awesome. And you guys should pick it up for sure. If you don't, that's okay. Because I know sometimes the variants don't always get in on time. Because one time... For the 164 variant, I wasn't able to get that variant till I think two weeks after the issue was released, because of shipping delays or something with Skybound or Image in my comic book store or whatever. So I wasn't able to get that variant until a while after the original cover came out. Um, so I was sorry, I was mad about that a little bit when they didn't have it. But I guess I mean I was okay as long as I get the variant somehow, one way or another. So. You guys, hopefully you guys pick this variant cover up and get the original cover as well. These things are both going to be released on June 7th as of my notice. At least this one will not complete. I'm pretty, yeah, this one will too. I remember seeing that. This one will also be released on June 7th. So make sure to pick this up at your local comic book shop. Thank you guys for watching my Walking Dead 168 variant discussion. Cool variant is for sure. And I'll see you guys next time on Rice TWD channel.